Hi, good morning. Neil Sean here. Nice to see you. Let's have a wave today. We're in Kensington Park. It's beautiful at this time of year. If you are in London and you want a bit of a tranquil walk, this is the place for you. By the way, it was open originally in the 16th century, but it really was the Victorians that turned it into the splendorous place uh, that we like today, you know, Hyde Park, Kensington Park. Really, everything started, I think, when you look at it with the Victorians. They had the incentive and, of course, the inventiveness, didn't they, to make things a little bit more accessible to the general public. The Victorian era, a lot to thank them for. Now, as ever, it's interesting with our latest breaking world story because, as we know, Meghan Markle had a bash, did she not, at her own podcast. Archetypes, or whatever it was called, Archetypes, I never really understood the title, you know? Wouldn't it have been simple to just call it something like Meghan Talks, you know? Simpler and easier for people to find. I guess they were going for the alphabet, ABC, that type of thing, you know? But of course, Meghan's deal with Spotify was worth mega millions, you know, and they waited a very long time to receive that particular podcast. Apart from Mariah Carey, as I said before, and Serena Williams, I truly can't remember anything much about it because it was a little bit worthy, a lot of people felt. What's interesting now to note, though, is this. Another member of the British monarchy has decided to go down the podcast route. But how successful will this be? Now, we're talking, of course, about the Duchess of York, Sarah Ferguson, who's teamed up with Sarah Jane Thompson, the editor of First News, to create what they're basically saying is talking tea, you know, spill the tea. I think that's the expression now, isn't it, for gossip? I think that's the right expression. I've got to keep up with these things, haven't I? I know. Bottom line is, apparently nothing will be off topic with this particular podcast. Now, I see problems here already, don't you? Because while you'll be able to apparently send questions in, to Sarah, will she really be able to offer advice or in fact reveal certain things about those daily headline news stories? It's going to be tricky and of course we'll have to be masked and make sure that people understand exactly what it's all about. You see, for Sarah, obviously, she's trying to branch out into the media world. Her books have become very successful for her. We saw her on that recent media tour across the United States, and apparently some of the books could even be turned into films. But as Megan found out, it's all about the guests, isn't it? Who you speak to and the engaging topics. Because for those that don't know, and there are quite a few, a podcast is simply a recorded conversation. Sounds a lot better, doesn't it, in the 21st century world? How would this bear up against, of course, Meghan Markle and her podcast? Could it go head to head? Who would you prefer to tune into? Or do you think it's absolutely wrong that royals should, in fact, be well, dishing things on podcasts? Whichever way, Sarah's hoping that you will take the time out to take tea with her on her latest venture. As ever, when I know more, you'll know more. Neil Sean in the very heart of London.